Uh, do you have any, have you had any trouble at all with, uh, you know, you say no, no matter what your viewpoint is or no matter what your cause is, th- there are people in this world who have causes which I would consider not to be very admirable. Uh, and I, 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 you know, I think we can all think of what some of those might be. Uh, have you, have you had any trouble with, uh, people wanting to promote an agenda that isn't something that ought to be promoted? Well, we know that there's that possibility. It hasn't come up yet, but there's that possibility. Mm -hmm. So far we found that the people who participate in this project they get what it's about, what it, what the energy yeah. is, what the purpose is. Yeah. And, you know, ultimately, I, I'm, I can't say that someday there isn't going to be some fascist neo-Nazi group mm-hmm. that comes in and wants to have a photo. Well, I've got an agenda. Right. You and know, why can't I be equal? Here's the issue is that we're not going to stand in their way because they... Interesting. Part of equality isn't making everyone the same, but giving everyone an equal opportunity to express themselves, whether it's the gay and lesbian agenda or the polygamists in Salt Lake, or it's the blacks or the Hispanics or Mm -hmm. the Asians. My job isn't to be the judge and arbiter of what equality looks like. It's up to me to simply give people a platform to have that conversation. And to be honest, neo-fascist Nazis are have as equal an opportunity to express themselves as the gay and lesbians or the LDS Mormon church or the Catholics. I'm not going to stand in that way. Now, obviously, I can give some guidance as to how, and we do, how we choose to have the photo represented. Um, but ultimately, we don't discriminate as to how someone wants to take a stand. Um, but thankfully, it's been so far that everyone who's participated gets what the energy of this is about. And we haven't had any hate groups and, you know, the the Westboro Baptist Church isn't mm-hmm. standing in line yeah. to come and take a picture with us. Yeah, I think that's. I think it's fascinating that uh, I think you seem to have some innate belief, too, that even if those groups did that, that human nature would, would the better side of human nature would prevail. And well, I, I think the power of the of the concept kind of defeats their purpose, because mm-hmm. if their initiative in taking an I am equal photo is to is to perpetuate hate, mm-hmm. it would fall flat. It wouldn't work. The, yeah. That photo and that message wouldn't mix together. You can't have an I am equal yeah. photo next to a neo-Nazi um organization and and think that that's even going to match up at all so it would if anything it would hurt their cause than than to promote it and in that case i'm great that an i am equal photo is is there to damage (laughs) their hate uh we're out of time okay thanks for being here uh go to the website uh i am equal.com to see the photos of what we're talking about you'll find more information about the i am equal world photo tour there uh you can also go to iamequalfoundation.org to find out about the corporate giving thank you i'm sorry we ran out of time but thanks for being here thank you melissa barlow events manager for i am equal uh, jason beckett ceo for i am equal thanks again i'm bill allred we'll be back again next time with more utah issues